Good morning and greetings and welcome to The Bright Side, your nutritional program dedicated to the understanding of the vast world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. I'm your host, Pharmacist Ben, nutritional pharmacist from Boulder, Colorado, registered pharmacist number 12275. I specialize in using nutritional supplements where other healthcare practitioners use toxic pharmaceutical drugs and deadly medical procedures. If you suspect that there are natural nutritional roads to your vitality and health and well-being and to addressing your health challenges, whatever they may be, but you don't know where to begin, you have come to the right place. As you listen to The Bright Side every day, you are more and more in control of your body. You are more and more knowledgeable, and you know you can overcome any health issue. That is why we are here every day on The Bright Side, helping clear up the sometimes confusing world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. Over the last 27 years of practicing pharmacy, I've seen drug-free recoveries from diabetes and hypertension and obesity and skin diseases like psoriasis and acne and rosacea and eczema, digestive ailments, autoimmune issues of all kinds. Recoveries that by the standards of modern medicine can only be called a miracle, but what is in the world of the body, what is in the world of biology, standard operating procedure, because the human biological system is a healing system, it's a regenerating system, it is designed divinely to heal and renew itself on a moment-to-moment basis. And while some folks may call that healing system a miracle, it really is no miracle at all. It is simply the way the body works. If you have questions about health or nutrition or prescription drugs, we're here for you. We welcome your calls at 855-660-4261, 855-660-4261. If you want to get off your meds and get on a good nutritional supplement program, if you have questions about the longevity products or formulations or skin care ingredients or something you may have heard on the news or from a friend, let us help clear up the confusion. 855-660-4261 is our bright side call-in phone number. If you want to purchase any of the longevity products you hear us talk about on the Bright Side, you can call the Bright Side Ben phone team at 866-735-2470. That's 866-735-2470. You can also head over to my website, brightsideben.com, and take a look at our shopping cart. All the longevity products are up, including the Beyond Tangy Tangerine, my personal favorite longevity product, the multivitamin mineral complex powder that you add to water and drink. It's 50 bucks a canister. Most folks will notice results within one or two doses, results like weight loss, appetite suppression, lower blood pressure, getting off your meds or at least weaning off your medication, just feeling better, more energy. You can find out all about it at brightsideben.com, or you can call the Brightside Ben phone team at 866-735-2470. Make sure you ask about joining the team, helping spread the word about the power and importance of a good nutritional supplement program, earning yourself some thank you checks while you're at it and getting your products at the wholesale price. They can tell you all about it at, uh, on the Brightside Ben phone team at 866-735-2470, or you can click on the Join the Team link on the upper left-hand corner of the page at brightsideben.com. Okay, we are talking about nerve chemicals, nerve transmission chemicals, so-called neurotransmitters, and specifically acetylcholine as it relates to cigarette smoke as well as to we're going to talk about uh, as it relates to cigarette smoke as well as to pesticides and nerve gas. But before we do that, I want to touch on something that we talked about at the end of the program yesterday, a subject that seems to have sparked a lot of interest. I got several emails. seems to have struck a nerve on this subject of aluminum, aluminum uh, toxicity and aluminum buildup. got a, a three emails, actually, on this subject, and I, thought, I think I may have caused a little bit of confusion. So let me see if I can clarify my thoughts, and then we'll move on to talking about acetylcholine and lipofusion and nerve gas and tobacco and cigarette smoking and pesticides. All right, so a couple of points I want to make here about aluminum. First of all, most importantly, a little over 8% of the Earth's crust is aluminum. After silica and after oxygen, it's the third most abundant element in the Earth's crust, and it's the most abundant metal. And that means that our earthly environment, our terrestrial environment, is packed with aluminum. Americans get somewhere in the order of 25 to 35 milligrams of aluminum every day, which in terms of minerals is quite a bit. Some of that comes from plants. Some of that comes from cooking utensils. Some of that comes from uh, food processing chemicals. Some of it may come from chemtrails and toxicity. But because aluminum is so poorly absorbed by the body when we're healthy, for most of us, aluminum ingestion is going to, uh, the aluminum that we're ingesting, I should say, is going to be excreted out of our bodies. So it's not going to be a big problem for most of us. Now, while metallic, non-plant 
aluminum is toxic if it's ingested in sufficient quantities. And by the way, nobody knows what those sufficient quantities are. And because of the fact that aluminum is so poorly absorbed and most of the stuff that we ingest is going to be excreted, more than likely aluminum is not an issue. Even though non-plant processed aluminum, yes, is probably toxic. It's important to keep in mind, however, that the studies that are done on aluminum toxicity are typically done on non-plant forms of aluminum. And they also tend to be done using large quantities of aluminum. According to an article that was published in the journal Environmental Health Perspectives, this is a quote, levels of 5 to 50 times the normal daily intake of aluminum, that is, do not appear to interfere with metabolic processes. The adverse effects of aluminum reported in the more recent years resulted from the inhalation or ingestion of aluminum in concentrations many times greater than the amounts present under normal circumstances, unquote. What that basically means is to have any kind of aluminum toxicity, you've got to be eating a lot of aluminum. And you've got to be using a lot of aluminum cans and a lot of aluminum utensils, and you've got to be breathing in a lot of aluminum chemtrails. For most of us, aluminum ingestion is not going to be a problem. Secondly, the form of aluminum that comes from plants and the animals that eat those plants and plant-derived mineral supplements like the Beyond Tangy Tangerine is organic colloidal aluminum. It's protected by compounds that plants make that attach themselves to these metals and chemically transform them. This is such an important point because I keep hearing this idea about this confusion about metals and metals and minerals and minerals. There's, there's metals and there's minerals that are toxic. There's metals and minerals that are non-toxic, and they can be the same metal and mineral. There can be, you can have aluminum that's non-toxic. You can have aluminum that's toxic depending on what a plant does to it. This is the difference between plant-derived minerals and metallic minerals. This is called organic minerals. Organic minerals are the kinds that are transformed by plants and inorganic minerals. Minerals that are organic have been transformed by plants are not toxic. In other words, natural aluminum that's found in foods, natural aluminum that's made in plants, not the aluminum from food processing chemicals, not the aluminum from vaccines, not the aluminum from drugs, the aluminum that's found in plants is non-toxic. Additionally, there is some evidence, albeit not a lot of evidence, but there is some that suggests that aluminum may actually have some nutritional value. Yesterday I talked about an article that discussed the health benefits of aluminum as it involves energy production chemistry. A dietary deficiency of aluminum in goats was shown to uh, result in increased abortions, as well as nervous system breakdown, as well as decreased longevity. Aluminum has been shown, uh, aluminum deficiency has been shown to decrease growth in chicks, and aluminum has been described in experiments as being required for bone growth, for DNA synthesis, as well as for energy metabolism. And you can find all this information on page 15 of the book, Clinical Nutrition of the Essential Trace Elements and Minerals, published by the Humana Press. Now, metallic aluminum that's found in antacids and various drugs and, and baking powder, vaccines, food processing chemicals, this is not the same as organic, colloidal, plant-derived aluminum. That stuff is toxic. Metallic aluminum, drug aluminum, vaccine aluminum, processing chemical, uh, food processing chemical aluminum, uh, aluminum and chemtrails, that stuff is toxic if it's ingested in sufficient amounts. Nobody knows what those amounts are, but certainly you don't want to be interacting with the stuff if you don't have to. Yes, metallic aluminum, the metal, non-food form, is in sufficient quantities. Again, no one really knows what those are, but in sufficient quantities, it's very likely going to be a problem if you ingest enough of it. Aluminum can interfere with other minerals, phosphorus, magnesium, maybe calcium. It's probably a good idea not to be ingesting a lot of this metallic form of aluminum. But this is not the same as the aluminum that's processed by plants and ingested by animals that eat those plants. Or the aluminum that's in the plant-derived mineral products, the longevity products like the Beyond Tangy Tangerine. Remember, aluminum is abundant. If it was all that toxic, we'd be in big trouble. Is excessive ingestion of metallic aluminum a problem? Perhaps. In laboratory, laboratory experiments, high amounts do indicate there is some brain toxic effects, high amounts. And there's also probably kidney effects, too. The kidney's going to be eliminating some of that aluminum. But you've got to ingest lots of aluminum for these things to happen. And whether or not, aside from in drugs and perhaps in processed foods, we get enough to cause the problems up for debate.
All right, we'll come back. We'll talk about neurotransmitters. I'm Pharmacist Ben. You're listening to The Bright Side. You have all seen and heard about the elements of the periodic table. These elements are the building blocks of everything in the universe. You, my friends, are made from these elements. A shortage of any of these important trace elements can lead to disease. Go with the science and take the Lady Talk Health Challenge and get all 90 essential trace elements with a healthy start pack at LadyTalkLive.com or call 855-333-LADY. That's 855-333-5239. Research shows it's not just what you put in your body that counts, it's what you put on it as well. Why not use an all-natural, healthy, mineral-based makeup that actually benefits your skin? Once you experience the airiness and flawless coverage of Longevity Mineral Makeup, you will never use anything else. With Longevity, the perception of your complexion will be natural perfection. Animal-friendly mineral makeup at Mary Lou Health. That's M-A-R-I-L-U Health dot com. Or call 855-321-HEALTH. This is Bill Brown, Midas Resources Gold and Silver, government shutdown, inept politicians, unfunded entitlements, looming Obamacare, the death of the U.S. dollar as the global reserve currency is what nobody wants to acknowledge. We have a debt bubble that cannot be paid and will eventually crash the dollar. If you are concerned about maintaining your purchasing power, consider this. Gold and silver are up 497% in 13 years. Call me, 800-686-2237, extension 332. Together we can discuss your options of buying gold and silver. Analysts agree the dollar's problems are increasing. Call me, Bill Brown, 800-686-2237 at extension 332, and we'll discuss your option of buying precious metals. Also, I can send you information on how you can roll over your IRA or 401k into a precious metals IRA. Don't get caught with money in your account when the dollar collapses. Call me, Bill Brown, at Midas Resources, 1-800-686-2237, extension 332. Great news, pure water lovers. BigBerkeyWaterFilters.com has a special discount offer for all GCN listeners. You can't do better than a Big Berkey for economy. For only 1.7 cents a gallon, a single set of filters can last for 5 to 10 years. There's none better than a Big Berkey for emergency preparedness as a backup water source. And you just can't beat a Big Berkey to remove dangerous chlorine, all types of fluoride, pathogenic bacteria, cysts, parasites, and unhealthy bodies. Products from municipal water. Berkey water filter systems are even powerful enough to purify stagnant pond water. For the gold standard in water filters, get a big Berkey at bigberkeywaterfilters.com. And all GCN listeners get 5% off all ceramic filter systems. For details, call 1 877 99 Berkey. That's 877 99 B E R K E Y. Big Berkey water filters for the love of clean water. We live in a complicated society. Stressful issues are always popping up. Have you ever been treated unfairly by someone? Have you ever been overcharged for a repair? Have you ever signed a contract or a document? Worried about identity theft? How many times have you been in those unique situations where you just wanted to call an attorney to find out if you're right or wrong or what your legal rights are? But every time you think about calling an attorney, what do you think about first? That's right. Who do you call and how much will it cost? Our friends at Legal Shield have found a solution. With a nationwide network of 6,900 attorneys who average over 19 years of experience, Legal Shield's law firms take over 40,000 calls per week helping their members. For less than $20 per month, you can have access to Legal Shield on everything from the trivial to the traumatic. Let Legal Shield stand up for your rights at lsprotection.com. That's lsprotection.com. Or call 855-340-SAVE. 855-340-7283. Results will vary from case to case. We are America's largest independently owned communications network. GC. All right, we are back on the break side. I am Pharmacist Ben. Thanks for being here. We're on the air 8 to 9 Pacific and 10 to 11 Central Time, 24-7 on the archive page at brightsideben.com or the searchable archive page at benfuchsarchives.com. Thank you to Peter in the U.K. for setting that up. And apparently, I think that's, uh, if there were any problems, I don't know if there were any problems. Uh, Rose yesterday called and said there were some problems with the site, but apparently there's, uh, there either weren't any problems or there are no longer any problems. That's benfuchsarchives.com. If you want to search any of the programs, 
that you um, that you missed, you can head over there, or you can check out my blog, pharmacistben.com, which we update regularly with news stories and blog posts. We also have a link 